What is this? What is this? Literally. So here's my Christmas tree, guys. What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. It's TG Styles, aka TGSTYLZ, and I am back for another video. Give this video more life. It's like a lit YouTube video. <laughs> it's gonna be lit. Alright, you guys, so as you, first of all, before we even start this video, guess what it is. Like, guess what it is. Like, just guess. What, what is today? What is the start of this YouTube journey? Like, well, I wouldn't say journey, but like, what what's today? Like, y'all know what today is? I, well, I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you if you don't. It's Vlogmas, y'all. Like, literally, it's Vlogmas. Like, get with the if you're still stuck in November, um, Thanksgiving, get with the program. It's Vlogmas. I don't care about you. Vlogmas. 2022 Vlogmas, and I am here today to bring it to y'all with Vlogmas Day 1. So, let me address a couple things before I get into the video. For one, I know I look crazy, um, but that is actually why we're doing this video today because I'm going to show y'all how to do a really cute hairstyle that I think is like my go-to now because I literally do it so much that it's just become like, I'm going to do this. So, yeah, um, don't worry about that. Also, I haven't been posting as you guys can tell. Um, but I have been a little sick, so I kind of took, like, a long, long break. <laughs> but, I mean, we're back to it. We're not gonna focus on that negativity, because, you know, we're back. But, um, I am still a little bit sick. I'm kind of at the end of it, so if you could tell, like, a change in my voice, that's why. But I'm, I'm healing, you know? <laughs> so, besides the fact that I'm still a little bit of sick, sick a little sick besides that i still wanted to film because i did not want to let this vlogmas go to waste get straight to it on oh my mama we lit we finna get we finna get into it so before we even get into this video make sure you guys like comment and subscribe make sure you turn on post notifications if this is your first time seeing my channel you're gonna love it here so you might as well subscribe now um but yeah Without further ado, without any more talking, let's get straight into this video. I didn't even tell y'all what the video was going to be. So before we get into the video, today's video is going to be a tutorial on how I do my Barbie ponytail. Not really tutorial, but kind of tutorial. Like, I don't know if y'all will be able to follow the steps that I do. But, um, yeah, I'm just going to show y'all how I do the Barbie ponytail look and how I'm going to achieve it today. So stay tuned. Make sure you like and subscribe. Comment below what, comment below video ideas for this vlogmas because I really want to know what y'all want to see. Um, and yeah, let's just get straight into the video. Alright you guys, so as you can see that I'm standing up, um, the way that my camera tri is on the tripod, I have to stand up to do this entire video, unfortunately, but um, hopefully by tomorrow, for the next video, I'll have like a better setup for y'all. But first things first is I'm gonna show you guys everything that you're gonna need to achieve this hairstyle. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I kind of pre flat iron my hair a little bit. Um, I just did a, you know, I just did a quick little flat iron, not too much of this. I just quickly went in and flat ironed it just to get my hair as straight as possible just to have a, like a sleeker look because you don't want to have like your hair just you know so you want you kind of want to like go in and like flat iron you don't have to flat iron your hair you could just blow dry it too that works so whatever works for you so first thing you're gonna need is some type of edge control some type of gel i'm going to be using edge control i use edge control more than i use gel because I really feel like edge control works better for me. So I'm going to show you guys the edge control that I use. The next thing that you're going to need is 
helping the camera to be in focus. But the next thing that you're gonna need is a comb. I have this rat tail parting comb. This is like seven dollars. Um, cause it's it it's like a special type of comb. You're gonna need some bobby pins. So make sure you have you just a couple of these right here. Just a couple, not too many, but like just a little bit. Um, you might need some scissors just to cut the hair for if you're going for that Barbie ponytail type of look, which is what I'm going for. But if you're not and you just want like a straight ponytail, you're probably not gonna need scissors. You might need scissors if you want to cut it shorter, but yeah. You're gonna need an edge brush. Mine's broke, but we're not gonna talk about that. Um, and you're also gonna need a brush. So without further ado, let's get straight into this hairstyle. So I do not have the pack that the hair was in, but you're also gonna need like some tear, like the tracks. This is not the whole track, like the whole pack, but I just have some right here just to show you. This is like the straightest piece. So, but yeah, if I can find the hair that I use, I'll put like a picture right here so you guys can see the hair that I use. But yeah, without further ado, let's get straight into the hairstyle. All right, you guys, so first thing that you're gonna wanna do is just, you know, here's my hair, by the way. It looks crazy, but what you're gonna wanna do is kind of mold your ponytail. So you're gonna take your hair, kind of just brush it up or comb it up into a ponytail. So we're gonna get it to like, the middle of our hair and then we're gonna start molding the ponytail you're also gonna want to get a ponytail holder I suggest using the ones that don't have that little like metal piece around it so you're gonna want to have like these ones because these do not break easily like these are actually really good so these you should definitely use them but yeah let me focus all right, so I'm gonna take my edge control. Well, before I take my edge control, actually. All right, so what I'm gonna do first is I'm going to take my hair and I'm going to put it in like a kind of, not tight, but like a little ponytail. Just to position where I want my ponytail i want it kind of like right here so i'm gonna like yeah. then i'm gonna take out my edges because i kind of want big edges for this style so i'm gonna take my comb I'm trying to show y'all and then like look in the mirror at the same time it's kind of hard but i'm gonna just take some hair out for the edges. so I went ahead and took out my edges I did cut the back of my hair so if you can tell that it's kind of short that's why I just cut it I don't know why but it's starting to grow back so that's actually good but um what I'm doing right now is I'm going to now that my edges are taken out and separated from the rest of my hair I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to start molding my ponytail now what I mean by mold my ponytail is I'm gonna take my gel we're gonna remove this here's some little asmr for people who like this i don't know but here you go um we're gonna just you know gonna make sure the camera's focus so here is a new 
you know, it's control. I don't know. Do do y'all like? Okay. Anyways, <laughs> but um, now what I'm gonna do <clears throat> is I'm gonna take my edge control and I'm just gonna put it around my hair. So I'm just gonna place edge control on my hair. Put it in the back. Now the reason why I use edge control instead of gel to do this, because it's kind of usual that people use gel, but I use edge control just because I feel like it gives me a better, a better hold than gel does. I don't like using gel for my edges or for my hair. I just use it for my entire head like I don't like using gel especially like eco styler or other jams I don't really like using those because I feel like it doesn't sleek my hair good enough like edge control does sorry I'm like out of frame but I feel like edge control just sleeks my hair a lot better Alright you guys, so I'm just going ahead and I'm just brushing up my hair and you can use a comb, like at this point you kind of want to go in with your comb and just comb up your hair just to get like a very nice sleek base for your ponytail. I don't want to put that much edge control in my hair, so I feel like this is a good amount. So we're gonna put a little bit more on the sides. Okay, but this is like pretty good. So now I'm gonna go in with one final brush up. And you're gonna take your ponytail holder and you're going to tightly you kind of want this to be tight so you're gonna put this ponytail in kind of tight I'm not gonna lie and like i said i am still sick so you guys can probably tell but that's why i'm sniffling a lot but yeah now i'm gonna go ahead and take this these little things off my edges backs and things oh one thing i forgot to mention is you're gonna need a flat iron to curl if you're doing like the curled edges look you're gonna want to take a flat iron to like curl this but i'm i'm gonna curl my edges at the end so you guys will see that but right now i'm gonna take my broken edge brush and i'm gonna just go in just to extra sleek it. Alright you guys, my bad. My battery camera is almost dying, so I'm kind of going to speed this up just a little bit, but not rush it. But what you're going to want to do after you sleep your hair, you're going to want to braid your hair. So I'm going to go ahead and braid my actual hair. Mm -hmm. And you want to put like a rubber band at the bottom of it just to secure the ponytail. So I'm going to go ahead and secure this. Alright you guys, so this is where it gets difficult. But this is where you're going to do this. So you're going to take your track. This is how it looks. It has like this little 
uh, track. So you're going to take the track and you're going to put it at the start of your braid. And I'm doing the bobby pin method. So you're going to put it at the start of your braid. And you're going to take a bobby pin and you're going to stick it in the hair. That was a fail. So you're going to take the bobby pin and you can wrap it around once, but I usually don't, but you're going to take the bobby pin and you're going to stick it right in, I just messed that up, but you're going to stick it right in the braid so the hair is nice and secure. And then you're going to just wrap, like you're going to just wrap. So I put the bobby pin in there to attach it. You're gonna just wrap the hair around your hair, around the braid. If you do want this ponytail to be longer, you can add weave to your hair. If your hair is not that long, you can add weave to the braid that you did. And then you can start wrapping, but I don't, I'm going for a Barbie ponytail look, so I don't want to, um, I don't want to use any weave for the ponytail. So as you guys can see, I'm just going ahead and I'm wrapping it around. And since this track has come to an end, I'm going to put a bobby pin on it to secure it. Put a bobby pin on it to secure that. Stick it right there. All right, so I'm gonna come back when I finish the ponytail, finish adding all the hair. And I'm gonna show you guys how to hide your hair with the track and everything. So I'll be back in like three seconds. All right, you guys, so I am back. Um, I thought I could do this off camera. Um, I think it's the hair. I I'm just gonna show. BTO pickle chin that boy, egg on that concrete hair that boy, oh head that boy, oh dirt that boy, stink that boy, afro hair that. I, I don't know what happened. Um, I, I thought I thought I had it, but like like with this, like it, it probably would look better if I cut it right, you know like. Oh, uh, uh. yes, yes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Step up, okay, um, step up. I think we're gonna just stop this video. Um. I don't know if, okay, it might be okay, like, it might be okay, um, not sure what I did wrong, but it has, my ponytail has never looked like this, um, it's not that bad. Um, well, all right, you guys, as you can, well, all right, you guys, as you can tell by this, the, the way that this looks, um, I did not do this right. Um, the base is kind of lit though, like, the ba the base, like, it looks, it looks kind of good, like, the base low key. No. Okay, um I'm gonna take this out. This looks actually terrible. Like I it was okay, but like I, I kinda like gave up because it wasn't working. So um yeah, not really sure. Okay, just give me a second to like take this off. 
Alright you guys, so um I kind of tried to do this um but it didn't go as planned as you can tell. Um I don't know what happened or what I did wrong, so um yeah. The camera battery is flashing, so I want to go ahead and give you guys an outro before this video ends. Happy Vlogmas, for one. Hopefully, tomorrow's video is way better than this one, because I don't know what this video even is. Like, why? I tried, but it didn't really work. Um, it was a complete fail. Um, yeah. There, there's, like, gel. Um, so, um, I hope you guys kind of enjoyed this video like i hope you kind of got like the gist of the how to do this this is not a tutorial at all this is like a film um so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this crazy not even hair tutorial video um hope you guys enjoyed make sure you like comment and subscribe make sure you turn on post notifications and stay tuned for this vlogmas because it's gonna be very lit so i will see you guys hopefully that was focused this whole time but my arm is kind of hurting holding this gigantic camera but i will see you guys in tomorrow's video bye why what is this what is this literally it doesn't even match my hair like what was i thinking do you guys want to see my christmas tree I feel like we can like at least enlighten this vlog. I can show you guys my Christmas tree. Um, I just don't understand Christmas, I guess.